hello my lovely little coffee beans my name is Sarah welcome to or welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be reorganizing my bookshelves so new year new me you know what they say but I say new year new bookshelves so I'm just gonna be revamping my shelves reorganizing my shelves for the new year for 2021 and I figured I'd film it and bring you guys along so I hope you enjoy this video and yeah let's just get into it okay so here's kind of what we're working with so I have my little like reading corner here and I do have a new TBR cart that I can put together I already have one in my room but this will be strictly for monthly TBRs and stuff like that and then this used to be my Twilight and Stephen King shelves and then at the very bottom all my book of the month books but I think what I'm gonna do is move all of my book of the month books to my tiny shelf in my room that I have now so I'll probably take those off and then I don't know what the heck is happening here okay and then here is what my shelves in my room currently look like I've hauled a lot of books as you can see since I first put my bookshelves together the first time and then I have my little pop sockets at the top but I have them in alphabetical order by author's last name except for all the ones that are stacked but I'm not sure if I want to do that again or if I want to switch it up and do it by height or by color I'm not really sure yet and then this little shelf right here is the one I was talking about that I have in here now where I can put all of my book of the month books. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. And it did get a little messed up. There's a little hole back there from when I moved it from Washington to Georgia. I think it'll be really cool to have my book of the month books all together on this shelf and then make the tall skinny bookshelf in my reading room for my favorite books and maybe more series books. And then over here, got my little kitty over here is my other TBR cart so I was thinking for this one I'll keep the top for my laptop and then maybe make the middle for maybe nonfiction books and poetry because I don't really like the way my nonfiction books and poetry books look on my shelves right now I just have them at the very bottom and then I even have some classics on my shelves, like one flew over the cuckoo's nest, why can I not say that? And then The Age of Innocence, and then I have As I Lay Dying and stuff like that. So I think I just want to put all of my classics, poetry, and nonfiction books on here, and then maybe my big series, aka the Ingus Thong series. And the click series that I'm gonna do for a video coming up pretty soon and maybe hide my Harry Potter books on the very back of this so they're not displayed on my bookshelves anymore because JK Rowling is canceled but anyways so I think that's what I'm gonna do with that but now let's just get into the montage of me putting everything together
shit out of me. What do you want? You just got that on camera. <laughs> oh my god, I thought you were a murderer. <laughs> okay, anyway, hi. Hi. Oh. I just did a poll on Instagram where I asked if I should organize my shelves by height or alphabetically by author's last name and height won. So I'm trying to think of the best way to do this. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put all paperbacks on the top three shelves on both sides and then hardcovers on the bottoms. But then I have some series that are mix like the first book would be the first book as paperback and then the rest are hardcovers so my sister had the great idea where I should put all of my series in the middle and I could do paperback on top and then whatever I don't really know how I'm gonna do that but do series on this smaller shelf and then do everything else here Hopefully you'll see what I mean when I organize it, but I'm gonna do it by height, but keeping series together and keeping all paperbacks together and all hardbacks, hard, blah, 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 hardbacks together. I think that's the plan, but it might change, who knows.
sorry for the horrible lighting, but I saw my ring light on. I finally finished. I finally, finally finished. It took me forever to figure out what I wanted to do with my big shelves, and I did a couple polls on Instagram. So thank you to everyone who voted in my poll, and I ended up just doing it alphabetically by author's last name, and I ended up doing half um paperbacks and then half hard covers on the bottom you'll see in a second but i'm just gonna go ahead and show you and then i did find a couple stephen king books and i think one book of the month book and a couple non-fiction books that were on this big shelf that i moved to their respective shelves so now i'll just take you to every bookshelf again and let you see the final final look Okay, I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm ready.
so so much for watching this video if you liked it please give it a like um subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll see you next time bye